What's up everyone? It's TechnoLionX and today we are going to give you the review of Nova Launcher Prime 2.1. The Nova Launcher Prime 2.1 is used when you want the Nexus UI, that is the stock UI, on your customized HTC, Samsung or maybe LG or other mobile companies that produce Android devices. Basically these Android devices that the other companies produce have some modifications than what the Nexus devices have. The Nexus devices are pure Android. They contain the stock UI, the vanilla UI. And many people admire that. And maybe sometimes you want to switch to some great UI which you like. So, the Novo Launcher Prime 2.1 might be the perfect choice for you. But the thing is, is it good for you to spend bucks on it let's check it out in this video the Novo launcher prime 2.1 give you gives you the exact feel of the android 2.3 4.0 4.1 or 4.2 stock ui it has multiple options the first thing that you notice over here is this round circular app drawer icon it takes you to the app drawer there are two tabs over here the apps and the widgets tab the apps tab is somewhat like the nexus UI and it also has this cool effect of the card stack known as the card stack effect the next step widgets will take you to all the widgets that you have on your mobile. These widgets, after the phone is upgraded to Android 4.1, these widgets can be hold and they can be put onto any home screen that has the space, as you can see over here. But it needs the Android 4.1 update. The next thing that I'm going to show you is the settings of Nova Launcher Prime. There are multiple settings available on the Novo Launcher Prime 2.1. First of all, you can see the desktop. In the desktop settings, you have all the multiple settings like the desktop grid, width margin, height margin, person search bar. Now, this is a cool feature that the Novo Launcher Prime gives you. The person search bar is basically the Google search bar, but it has the availability on all the home screens. The scroll effects. Now these scroll effects are available only to those who buy the full version, that's the Novo Launcher Prime. A free version of the Novo Launcher is also available on Google Play Store, but that's not having all the features of Novo Launcher Prime 2.1. The, the same options, similar options are available in the drawer tabs and many more things. The icons can also be set according to your personalization. There are multiple themes available on the Play Store. You can just pick, pick uh, any one of them and you can just select. Like I have over here the stock jelly bean theme, sense theme, touch with sense 5 theme and the default default Nova theme. I basically like the stock jelly bean theme because it gives me the pure Google experience. You can also set the background transparency of the app drawer. So this is a very nice launcher and I think then it's good for you if you can spend some bucks on it thanks for this for watching this review and click the thumbs up button if you like this video thank you